in this regular season? Coach Madison's the same. Coach Brown, um, this is our first role with him, so... I mean, he's been the same as he was all season, so I, I'm assuming he'd be, he's the same uh, no matter what. You know, like you said, the same intense, funny guy that uh, just wants to win and does anything that he can to win, so he's been the same. Have you kind of noticed their interactions or, or their conversations or anything, the, the way that they, you know what I mean, kind of just the way, the, the way that they interact with each other? Have you paid attention to that? I think there's a more sense of urgency, but at the end of the day, they're the same two coaches that have been together for the last... 12 months now, so um, nothing's really changed much. How Chris, we the legacy of the senior class. What's up? How can you think about the legacy of this senior class and uh, what you guys did to this program? Yeah, I think I think a lot of it will have to come down to this game. Really? Um, yeah, I mean, we're, this is the biggest game we're, we're playing goal wise. Um, when we get this one, it, it just sets us up for you know with recruiting and things like that, but also. Yeah. Just to leave a good taste in our mouth after that Ohio State loss, after not making it to the Big Ten Championship, after all those hopes and, and the goals we had at the beginning of the season, I think I think this game is going to say a lot about us, and uh, especially since this is our last game. You know, people say you're only as good as your last game, so um, getting a win in this game means a lot. But from where you guys were in 14 to you know to what you've done for this, you know to turn this program around, that this is essential to sustain that. I, mean, I think Coach Harbaugh is going to do a great job of sustaining this success that we've had the last two years. Um, but I'd like to think that the senior class has something to do with it. Um, so I think with this win, it'll, it'll just solidify it a little more. Jordan was just talking about the uh, the younger guys on the defensive line that will be playing next year. And he said they're, they, they looked pretty darn good in, yeah. uh, in bowl practice. Can you talk about... Will you enjoy watching them that next year? Yeah, I can't wait to uh, maybe even come back for spring ball a little bit after training and see what they're what they're what they've accomplished so far. It's 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 exciting to see them go to work um, in practice and in different drills, one on one pass drills. Um, it's going to be exciting to see what they can do next year. Um, they've had a lot of they've had a lot of playing time this year. Uh, so they'll just they'll, they'll be ready next year. It's, it's going to be exciting. We know about Hurst, Monet, Winovich. I mean, beyond that, <clears throat> somebody grabbed your eye. Uh, something that's really blossomed. He came in early. Carlo Camp came in early uh, in January. And as a 17, 18-year-old mid-year freshman, he's, he struggled a little bit. Uh, but this, in camp and then throughout the season, he's really gotten a lot better. Um, which, which is good to see because sometimes you have those questions of, of different players if they're going to pan out or not. And I think he's going to be a good player for us. Just, uh, just the fact that this is going to be your last game, how, how much have you thought about that? You know, I was telling other people, I don't think about it too much just because it's, I like to live in the moment. I like to just be around these guys, I guess, for the last time that we're all going to be together. It's going to be the last time um, this team is going to be the same with all these players. Um, but from the standpoint of my last game, I haven't thought about it too much. Um, I know in a month or so, it'll probably be a little different. I'll think about it a little more, but um, I'm just enjoying my time down here right now. Are you going to the Senior Bowl or Kevin Bowl? Are you going to one of these bowls? Or yeah, I'm thinking about um, the Senior Bowl. Okay. Um, we you haven't, haven't, haven't sent it. I haven't sent the invitation yet or accepted it yet. So um, we're kind of seeing how this game goes and how healthy I'm feeling and whatnot. So, um, that's kind of where it stands right now. Do you know where you're going to train? Uh, I'll be in LA, in Southern California, in the LA area. What's unique about what Florida State presents to a defense? Um, I mean, they have a dual threat quarterback that can run the ball and pass the ball. Um, he's very efficient at, at that. And they have one of the best running backs in the country. So uh, that duo is, is, is scary if you let them run wild, I guess. Um, they have a big physical offensive line. Um, so I guess as a defensive lineman, you look at those two or three things and that will stand out to you.